Um, how do I find my way to the community health center? Oh, oh. Just um, go straight, then take your left. My beloved Chikere. How is America treating you? How is your new job? I hope the season's snow didn't affect you. It's been six months now and I haven't heard from you. I am worried. You have not replied my letters. Is everything all right? Your mobile number is switched off. I want to hear from you. I want to be sure you are fine. I hope this letter finds you well. Always remember that I love you. Your love, Obiyama. your world. When was the last time she carried out in touch with you? You can't answer. Because he has not gotten in touch with you lately. Mama, he will call me. Maybe who knows? He's busy with his newfound job. What the price? He's busy with his newfound job. So busy that he cannot take out a few minutes to call you. Mom, laugh the ball away. Stop deceiving yourself. It's obvious Chica has found another woman over there. It's not possible. It's not possible, Mama. It's not possible. Did you say it's not possible? Stop deceiving yourself, Obiyo, Mama. Stop deceiving yourself. Look up to the realities of life. I mean, can't you see the handwriting of the wall? Why are you sitting here deceiving yourself like nothing is going on? The man doesn't call you, he doesn't write nothing. Now, let me tell you something. Don't you think Chikere has been calling his mother? Has it ever occurred to you? Because he doesn't call you. He doesn't call you because he's not interested. Yes, he doesn't. He's standing the wrong way. Let him look at that. Like a small school girl. Flat there, man. Stop deceiving yourself, my dear Obioma. If you like, don't go to sleep. Ma, you're not hungry. Why are you doing this to yourself? Eh? When would you realize that it is time for you to move on? I mean, Chikara silence says it all. He has no time for you. 
You come and forget that man and, and handle your life and move on. I mean, there are a lot of young men out there that are ready to marry. If only you would give them a chance. <laughs> Why are you hurting me? Mama, you're hurting me with your words. Chicken hasn't said you won't get married to me. Why are you saying all this? Why are you saying this? He loves me. Hey! Eta Lola! Mom, wake up! Wake up! Oh. Have you not heard of um, Nigerian young men that travel abroad and then they come back with white wives? You need to surprise their Nigerian women. He's not even married to you yet, though. Mama, I will hurt you. But I still want to remind you that Chikere hasn't forgotten about me. And he will get married to me when he returns. It's too early for this. <laughs> Let me tell you something, or whether you get angry or not, I will be here waiting and I will sit here and laugh at you when the time comes. Nenon, no, no. Check out that last smack. Ilo, you go on where bow. Now, why in the young girl, what man to one day, Jan? As for the Nama, what are you? Content. Don't ask me that question. I want my money. The only language I want to hear now is my money. Jeff, I, I, I told you to be patient. Patient? For how long will I be patient? Oh, you think I don't know that you sent the money to your boyfriend in abroad? Thank God he is making money now. So, I want you to call him. I'm telling him to send my money within three days. I, I said three days. If you don't send my money within three days, I will disgrace you in this village. I said three days. Three days I give you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let me assist you. No, I'm almost through. Except you help me to bring this one. Oh, okay. Uh. <laughs> hey. Where have you been now? Mm -hmm. Thank God, my daughter. Hey. Don't leave us, but uh, <laughs> don't worry, I'm here now. I know. I even know you. Oh. Oh, this top is beautiful. It's original. Yes, it is. Chigari sent it to me. Not so many clothes from it. Ch Chikere did. What was that? He brought plenty of dollars. Can't you see I'm putting on with now? <laughs> see, if you go inside, you see slippers, shoes, fine handbags. Lekwapo. Yes, my one. My one is my friend. Hey. Mama is very beautiful. Mama, <laughs> uh, let me bring more water. Let me bring more water. Do you know Chikari has been sending things to his mother? Chikari sent his mother clothes, bags, shoes. Is this how wicked men could be? My dear, you don't have to kill yourself. I do. 
Maybe one white woman has been occupying his time in Rade. I've always told you to get a man. Get a man so that you won't get caught and it's a bone. Did you say white woman? Black man. I think I can take this anymore. This is unfair. You deserve to be happy. You want to be happy. You don't really want to be happy. I'm not going to eat. Let me see you. Black man. Simplest to come and donate. But my older brother is not in the country. Look, look, we have to do something fast. Get call somebody, a relative, a friend, or something. Or better say, if you have money, let's get some blood from the blood bank. Please, excuse me. I don't have any money. Yes. 
they have lost their partner, they have lost their partner. Please, fast. We have to save this woman. Please. Yes, come in. Doctor, I'm afraid there is a problem. What's the problem? Doctor, their blood types are not the same. Shaisa, what do you mean? I don't know. No. Doctor, oh, my mother, my mother, my mother. She's shivering, she's shaking. Please come in. Look, let's go and see what is happening. Lives. How are you doing today? 
goed zien je bent. Let the Lord see good. Amen. The helper will come your way in time of need. Amen. You will never die young. Amen. You will never die poor. Amen. Amen. God will surely bless you. Amen. Amen. Take care of my mom. Okay. Let me see you. To where? To see you to the office. Yeah, Richie, don't worry. Soon I'll take you to my office. But for now, you have to stay with my mom. Take care of her. Okay. Take care of her. See you Okay, bye. Salary. What? What are you doing with your money? Obioma. Obioma. How many times did I call you Obioma? See, the truth is that I am giving you one month. In this one month, if I don't get my money, Obioma, believe me, heaven will fall. I have just told you. When are you going to fix uh, that leaking roof that I mentioned to you? You promised you would fix it this way. Mama, I told you I'm going to do something about it. I'll do something about it. When? When is the question? This morning? Tonight? Tomorrow? I need to know when you're going to fix it. I don't have money now, but I'll do something about it. That is all I keep hearing from you. You have no money. You never have money. You're a working class girl. What do you do with your money? Where do you keep your money? I'll fix it. Where? Look at the roof. It's leaking badly. Eh? Before you know it, we'll be swimming inside this house. Better do something about this thing and do it fast. Mama, come with me. I've heard you, but I'm going to fix it. Is it not just a silly? I'll do it. Oh, Mama, I'm running late. I need to be on my way. Ah, I'll time with this one. Okay? Working class girl, and yet every time I ask her for money, she says she doesn't have. Something is wrong with this girl. Oh, my friend, I'm Mom, 
Cooking when I heard you were around, so I said to come and see you. Don't be still. You should have washed up. You stink. Don't drink. Don't. Honey? You okay? Where is she? Oh, oh one of those village bingos that helps Mama always see Charles. Oh. And why is she ice creaming? Whoa! I'm like a village girl, you know, she saw a truck and she screamed. When she sees my Bugatti back on the stage, she got a drop there. Yeah, baby. That's <laughs> loud, Oh my god. Wow. She, she, she can't hear me. Chikiri has done what other men do. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. All you have to do is move on. Uh, oh? uh, it's okay, it's okay. It's so sorry, it's so sweet. Chikiri, help me, help me. I want to die, I want to die. I want to die, I want to die. I want to die. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go.
even though he leaking roof with my mother. It's my boss this past year. He sent chicken everything I had on me. I will have tomorrow from Emuji. I will have tomorrow from Emuji to give to chicken. <laughs>
Why are you behaving as if I could to die in the neck? I must feel you don't love me if you return. But Bioma, I can never leave you. I love you and I'll miss you. I love you too and I'll miss you too. You won't wear your shoelace. Don't worry. I'll get a golden shoelace over there. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm just a shirt. Mm. You forgot your shoes. <laughs> Mama, I won't be needing these shoes over there in America. You will get better ones, okay? Just take care of yourself. Obi and I will be coming around to help you with some domestic work. It's okay, my son. And you make sure you don't come back in with another one. Mama, I cannot live with you. She's my wife. Take care. You can never trust a man until he has gotten all he wants. Mama. Hey, Mama. Mama. I have to catch up with my friends. Okay, okay. Mama, pray for me. I will not be my life. But look at But look at that. Okay, Mama. Love you, Mama. I'll see you later. 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 I'll see you
Actually, it's just something in the Wow. When I saw you in the streets, I couldn't get my eyes off you. You're right. You're dumb. such girl. Ha! What is wrong with Obioma? Why do you want to leave her? Because she's done nothing wrong. Wait, wait. Don't tell me you want to leave her because of that smoker of a girl you brought home. Mama, do not address my fiancé as such. Don't tell me how to address her. Now tell me. Mama, I was never holding Obioma. Look! I never took any drink to her parents. Mama, I have made my choice. Obioma is not good enough for me. I disagree with that. I will not leave and allow you to treat her that way. Why don't you send words to her all this way to marry? When you knew you are no longer interested in her. Mama, is Obioma a baby? Doesn't she know when the water stop running? Mama, look, I cannot come back from America and get married to a village girl. Bush girl. Mama, look at me. Just look at me. I'm polished. Shut up, Mama. Shut up, Mama. Your mind is not a village girl. They will not issue. <gasps> Tigeri, do you realize she can place a curse on you for treating her this way? Mama, let her go ahead and place a curse on me. Let her even carry her what I'm put on my head. Mama, look, it's over. I said it's over. Over! Tigeri! Tigeri! What's wrong with this boy? If I'm going to carry him back, Tigeri! I'm talking to you! Come back here! Let's go, 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 let's go
Mama, Mama, good morning. Good morning, my daughter. I hope you had a good night's rest. I slept with Mama. What about you? Oh, to Tama, she let you. Oh, to Tama. from the bank the other day. Yes, I, I went to the bank the other day, but I have the money here, but I give you everything. I will have nothing left to repair a lady. See, I don't care. All I need now is my money. That money is too big for me to leave for you. I want my money now. I need my money, oh. I need my money. Oh, wait. Do you want people to gather here for us? No. Fine. So, give my money. Give my money now. You're looking at me. You failed. Hope this money is complete.
be on my No, Sabiora. Your mother is in a critical condition. The result of her very true that she has in the year. And you need to make some deposit so that we can give her proper treatment. Oh, Dr. Fino has not been paid. We are all paid last month. You, you understand? Make me understand. You've been working here close to two years. Are you telling me you've not been saving? Doctor, please. This is a long story. All I want you to help me do is just to take good care of my mom. While I go out there and run out for money. Please, I I beg you, please. Oh, so be on my work. I know you rule here. I don't want to run into problems with the director. If there's anything you can do to raise money, please. Do. Please. And do that fast. That's the only way I can help you. I know, but... Doctor, you, you could still do something. Robert, thank you. Please, make it fast. of correction, call me child money. She's dying. I thought you work in a hospital. Why didn't you take her there? She's already in the hospital, but you know, they won't treat her if I don't deposit money and I don't have. Yeah. I don't have money also. You know pneumonia is it's a dangerous sickness. Please. She's dying. Please. Opium. I said I don't have. Why are you looking for every opportunity to speak with me? Why? No, I'm not looking for opportunity to talk to you. I'm only here for help. She can help me. Have we to be serving all this while? Last money I had on me, I sent it to you while you were abroad. You had problems. 
Look, look, look. Let me tell you this. Don't think I survived in America with a little change you said into me. Look, I walked out for my money and I earned it and I got a name. Jack money. So I don't have any money? Period. Yeah. Okay, you have this money. Please, I beg.
your senses? I'm, I'm so sorry, sir. How do you mean you're sorry? Huh? I'm sorry, my mind wasn't there. I'm sorry. How do you mean you're sorry? Hey, 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 look, look, look at me. I'm talking to you, you're walking out. Huh? No, please, I am sorry. Oh, no, I guess you're looking for someone else to run the trouble, not me. No, sorry. You better watch it. I said I'm sorry. Sorry. It's okay. um, where are you headed to? Do you mind if I leave you a I'll drop you. My home is just down there. I know. And that is why I want to drop you, okay? Hey, come on. I'm sorry. I know. I have heard you. Every, every, every person has this issue they don't feel like sharing with strangers. <laughs> okay, then stop seeing me as a stranger, okay? Can you please tell me what is not true? Always busy at work. Yeah, I know. And that's the reason why I'm not going to visit you. Not to worry. I'll come at the right time. Is that a yes? Yes. I said, prepare some and take to mama. Stay there and be talking about chicken. Me. Hey, motherfucker, what are you gonna do to me? 
You I'm trying to kill you in this member! Man, fuck for you, you King! Come in! I'm gonna kill you! Let me get this dude, okay? I'm gonna go on my feet. 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 I'd rather have to go back to school today if possible, okay? I think you're the remaining of your mother's welfare. Thank you. Thank you so much. God bless you. Amen. God will bless you too. Now you have to hurry up, okay? I will run down to the site this time and I'll come pick you later in the evening. Okay. God bless you. God bless you too.
Thank you so much for bringing us back. Eh? God will bless you abundantly. Amen. Amen. Mele, won't you come inside? Oh, not to worry. I have to rush to town to pick up something, okay? But I'll be back here tomorrow to check on your mama. Hmm? Be good. Okay. Bye. Emily. Thank you. Ah, you're welcome. You're welcome. So as I said, I will help you by tomorrow, okay? Be good. Bye bye. Yes, it is me. <laughs> I saw the way you were looking at me. <laughs> Stop! Oh. Emily! to share with you. <laughs> All right, on my way. Forget! You need to see this one. It's sick. She's someone I have the best in my taking my time to observe. I mean, she has all the qualities you will ever need in a woman. See, imagine a woman that is so beautiful, peaceful, calm, intelligent, and above all, very, very beautiful mama. You need to see her. I see <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, I'll bring that to you soon. You miss her.
Hello. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. How's work? You aren't stuck in me, are you? Is that what it's called? Stalking? Hmm? <laughs> Good evening. Good evening. Um, my mother wants to meet you. Your mother? Why? I don't know. You do, you know. Ah, uh, seriously, I don't know. But she has not met me before. Why does she want to see me? Nothing. She just wants to see me. Hey, don't give me that thing, okay? Come on, the car. Come on. Hold on, hold on. Can someone tell me what's happening here? Okay. Do you know her? She's the one I've been telling you about. She's the one that donated her blood to save a man's life. No, no, no. Wait a minute. You mean she's the one you... Oh my God. You are great! Mama, you see this girl. Mama, you see this I know he's hey, awesome. Yes, none like me. Man, I never me feature you come talk to me. Mama. Yes. Did I tell you about a helpless woman I donated my blood for? That woman in the hospital. Wait, wait, that time you came back and was asking for help. Oh, yes. yes, I remember. Mama, do you know that woman is Emilia's mother? I say, you're not serious. Eh? You're actually serious, eh? Mama, they were planning to come and see me before now. Hey! Hi! Hey. It is good to be kind. It is surely good to be kind. Mama, I am telling you. I am telling you, Mama. See, Mama, the truth of the matter is... Emilia proposed to me. I said... Hey! hey. And what did you say? Hey. Oh, I couldn't help myself out. I had to say... Yes, yes, big yes. You said yes. You yes. said yes. Yes, yes. 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 you're married here. Oh! Oh! You said that you came to come from Muka. Yes, so, Mama. You came from Yes. It's your book. Hey! Mama, you even said you must do everything before we came. So that by next month, you'll be taking me to London. Chow? London? Oh, young man, oh, young man came going to London. So finally you cross with the night. Hey! See Lagos! Mama. Before you go to hey. London. London. Hey! London. Oh! Hey! This God, eh? You are awesome God. Hey! Chuku! Amara ya baru bane baino Amara gi Obaru bane baino Amara chuku baru bane Amara chuku 
Hey, you know, I'm still surprised. Surprised at how you went out of your way to help us. I doubt if they even realize what you did for them. I mean, in spite of your own burdens that you had on your shoulders, you still did so much. Sometimes I just wonder why you did it. I don't care if they appreciate or not. Am I did it for God? I didn't do it for them. Am I remember what happened to Vicky? Uh -huh. to a community health center? Yes. And you expected to be there in the next 24 hours? Oh. Doctor, is there nothing we can do about this? Something like what? What are you saying? Um, we could reshuffle this. So I don't want to walk in a rural area. Please just tell me anything. I will give you anything. Just tell me what you want. Anything you want, please, Doctor. What? What are you really saying? Uh, trying to bribe me or what? No, no, not at all. I'm just asking if we could arrange something there. Yes. My goodness. You are a disgrace to so a medical profession. Leave my office. So this is not. I said leave my office! my office before I do something that you regret. Village. 
Obiama 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 I've been calling you since you used to answer me Sorry mama, I was washing Hey! Take a look at yourself Are you getting any younger? How do you know you almost scared me today? Was that? I mean that it's scared me Don't you think you should be getting married now? Now that you're young and fresh Like a boss Eh? Instead of wasting your life waiting for that stupid boy in America. Dilora! Hey, my marriage is not my problem. At least for now. No! It is my problem. Marriage is my problem now. So that I can carry my grandchildren and have an in-law that will help me take care of the things around this house. Yes! For you! You sit back. You waste your time getting off the house, making love calls, sleeping love sleep, dreaming love sleep. That boy will not add anything to your life. The sooner you realize it, the better for you. Mama Biko, girl, can, can I just rest? We'll talk tomorrow. It's late. You only just told me out here to talk about marriage. How will get married when the time comes? Will you leave me alone? Yeah. When which time comes? It's a quick time are we talking about? Doctor today, I heard he has been transferred. The new doctor is on her way. What about my uh, my letter? Letter? He didn't drop any letter. So what did they tell you at the headquarters? They said I must go with a referral letter, else they wouldn't say treat me. You serious? Yes. Yes, please. You have to. I can't do anything now. I think you should just go and see Dr. Ben. Who knows, maybe he'll do something. Hmm? Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You've been caring and so helpful to me. God bless you. Bless you too. It's my job. Thank you. See you later. Food items now. <laughs> 500 naira to buy food items. What do you think 500 naira can buy? Mama, you said you need to buy food items, and I've given you money, and you're here complaining. You know, sometimes you, you just behave as if you do not have any money. What is this now? Eh? Or you don't know what is happening in the country? I don't have. You never have. And you do not care. Do you realize that I use my life savings to send you to nursing school? I know that you're out, you do not care for us, you do not provide for us. 500 naira to buy food things. It's not fair. Eh? You don't care about me, you don't care about your brother and also. Hey. Mama, what is it now? Why are you making me look like I don't take good care of you and also? Why? But do you think 
care of us? Tell me, when was the last time you visited Nonso in school? Uh, very soon you will be kicked out of school. Eh? Lady caretaker, I can see you're taking very good care of us. Look, if I had an in-law, at least he would have made sure I had Ooroko and Mangala to eat. Then I would look fresh and young. Manamba, you will not give us the money, you will not marry. My people don't start, please. I shouldn't start. Yes. I shouldn't start. Kangwaki, if you're not ready for me to talk about husband, then provide for us. Give us money to feed. What is all this nonsense? Manambiko, I'm going with it. I'll see you when I get back here. Five hundred. So we're waiting for you. When you come back, you chew it now. Why fetch it for no one?
Hello. Um, how do I find my way to the community health center? Oh, oh. Just um, go straight, then take your left. She can't even say thank you. I think you're this one now. This time, my reformer can show you. Are you blind? Can't you see the car broke down? Oh, sorry. Let me check if it's the battery so I can... What are you trying to do? I want to check if it's the battery so that I can help you and assist you and fix it. Are you a mechanic? Not really. So? I told you you don't know anything and you can't possibly fix this car. Just kindly help me push the car so that I can start it. Push it? <laughs> Sorry, I can't push. I'm not feeling so well. Please, um, if you can be patient, I will arrange some boys that will assist you and push the car. Arrange some boys? Oh my God, you all are all the same. You mean you can't get boys to help me push this car without asking for money? Excuse me, madam. I didn't say you should give me money. So what do you mean by the word arrange? You all are all the same selfish set of illiterates. Woman hates me. I mean, how can she ask me to come to this terrible place? Now my car broke down. I can't even find a mechanic to fix it. Hey, uh, madam, start the lesson. Are you sure? Just try it. Just help me close the bonnet. Okay, okay, ma'am.
Toko. Yes. Uh -huh. Thank you. Soon are wicked though. Just to find me. Even smart you know. Hi. Don't worry. Tomorrow is another day. Mr. Mom, will you get your filthy hands off that car? Sorry, ma'am. Do you know how much this car costs? Can your forefathers or your father afford this car? Sorry, ma'am. Sorry. Sorry for yourself. Anyway, what's your name? Biki. Wiki. Yeah, Chibiki. Don't you have an English name? No, ma. Sorry. I'm not an English man. You should have an English name. Alright, my name is Dr. Beatrice, but I like it when I'm called B. B? Yes, B. Is that why you're... Oh, oh, sorry. Well, it's okay, ma. I, I'm a farmer. Oh, I see. That's why you're always looking this um, dirty and kept. But why would a man like you be doing peasant farming? Because it's better than being a doctor. Oh. Anyway, it's my birthday on Tuesday, and I only thought it wise to invite you at least so that you could have some good food. You're always looking hungry and starved. By the way, when you are coming to my house, make sure you don't come looking all smelling and dirty like this. Clean yourself up. Is that okay? Madam, thank you. I don't go to bed this. My friend, that is a good response. Well, all that you said is even more true. Anyway, suit yourself. Why would they give this kind of doctor a, a license? No wonder your name is B. Forget your problems, forget your pride. We are here for a very short time. So you show love when you can. Yes, I, I, I went to the farm. Okay, you went to the farm? In your condition? No, so what, what do I do? Eh? I was hungry, so I had to go out for food. It's okay. <coughs> the good news now is that the new doctor has changed work. She is due to yesterday. Oh, really? Yeah. That's good news. So, can I go in now and see her? Mm, she has to go. You have to take number during consultation. After that, you go one after the other. Do you understand? So you have to go and come back on Tuesday. But before then, I promise I will get your food across to her.
week, right? Yes, Doctor. What do you want? It's not yet my best thing. Sorry, Doctor. I heard you are the, the new doctor at the hair center. Yes. Please. I can't. Um, Wiki or whatever you call yourself. I hope you're not thinking I'm going to give you some money because you helped me pick up my phone. Mr. Man, I don't have any money to give to you. Please. I can't. Why can't you just come down and listen to me? Okay. Listen. You need to help me. I'm dying. You're dying. Dying of hunger. Take a good look at me. Do I look like your mother? I mean, what is wrong with everybody in this village? Five people already came here to ask me for money since I got into this town. Why can't you all just look for something to do, get busy and make some money? I don't even know why I'm standing here talking to you. Better go inside before you spoil her, like you always do. Uh, we kill whatever you call yourself. Um, you can have this. I don't want it to look as if I'm not grateful that you picked up my. You said you were grateful. Well, my advice to you is that you go out, look for a job, work, make some money, be a man. Why are you doing this to me? You are too educated to, 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 to behave like this. I'm not an idiot, Doctor. Yes, I'm not an idiot. Why are you doing like this? Why are you so wicked? Now, just stop your God forsaken stories. Gather up your low self extinct personality and get out of my compartment, stupid. Mr. Man, I said you should leave. What's your tag number? 18. So why are you here? I'm good to Number 17 is not around. Well, Mr. Man, you shouldn't be smart to rush in before another patient. Dr. Ward, he left. You don't talk when I'm talking. This is my office. Or you want to insult me the way you did your daddy? Sorry for your stupid stuff. What are you still doing here? Thank you. 
Well, if that's why you're here, I have called up the party. Well, um, I'm not here for the party. I came to wish you well. It's well for you. What's that? Check it out yourself. Um, whatever you call yourself. Listen, if you think I will forgive you for shouting at me the other day, you lie. I won't. I must make you pay. I won't forgive you in a hurry. Even in the spirit of bed day? Who's smiling with me? What's so funny? I'm oh, sorry. It cost. My friend sits on the floor. You're just so lucky today is my birthday. Seriously, I would have smashed your head for trying to sit on your couch. Thank God it's your birthday. Well, have a nice place here. Oh, really? So you think because I was posted to this God forsaken? You think I'm a poor doctor? You think I don't have eyes for quality things or I don't know when, when I see something that is good? You see, that might be seen. What do you even know about quality things? Just hold on, let me get you something to eat because I know you're starving. No, I'm okay. No! I'm not hungry. You are not okay. You are very hungry. I can see it in your eyes. You are hungry. Doctor, please. Instead of giving me food, can you just give me your attention? Let me say, what is wrong with this man? Does this place look like a hospital to you? Just sit here and let me get you something to eat. to burn off. Yeah. Come, come back here. It's okay, I've put it down. Mama, I, I'm sorry, I entirely forget. Why won't you forget? Come on. I hope what I am suspecting has not happened. That boy has written to tell you that he's no more interested. God forbid. Mama, God forbid, there is nothing like that. There's he won't leave me. He won't leave you. Yes. <laughs> Look at you. He promised you that he was going to come back and take you to America. Two years! I don't know, but he's been gone. Mom, you've not even crossed River Niger. 
Eh? Mama, yes, he promised. But, Mama, you have to know that life over there is not easy. Life is not easy. That man is not going to marry you. If you like, wait, write love letters, he will not marry you. He will not come back here to marry you. Let me advise you. It is better for you to marry now than you are beautiful and young. And not wait until you are old and ugly. And then old man. Do you expect me to get this kind of money from where? You know, um, are we going to the market tomorrow hmm, in the morning to buy the things that I would need for the Omoa Okay. You know, I need to buy slippers handbag, headgear, and everything will cost roughly 10,000 naira only. 10,000 naira? But you promised to give me the money at the end of the month now. Don't you expect me to get that kind of money from you? What do you mean you don't have money? I saw you counting money the other day. It seemed you don't have money. Yeah? Mama, I wasn't counting any money. Huh. Oh, beyond my people, I don't have time for long term. Just give me the money you promised me. Let me go and buy my things one more other meeting. Me. I will not be the only one that will look different on that day. What? Why are you policing me? I said I don't have money. Moa, policing you. I don't have time for your English show. All I know is that you must give me the money that you promised me. What I give you the money? You're walking out on me. Oh, Jama. Oh, You will give me that money. This is my call. Oh, now. Can you rush your turn and fix something? Ah, uh, we staff, on each other. And we call it here. All is here now. Eh, big old man. Just uh, try and come back here. You know, there's no food in the house. Okay, I'm going to go. Eh, you help me buy um, our lady's bed uh, from on each other. I will if I see. You will see. Ada, chi acha. with anything stupid again. Doctor, please, can I have the medical history? Mr. Man, I have told you I don't want to talk about anything concerning that. What is wrong with you? Please, What rubbish are you talking about? I haven't forgiven you for what you did to me the other day.
how are you? Yeah, I was um I was here the other day and your wife said you went out. Oh yes, yes, yes. She told me. I hope all the time is not really cheap. Dr. Ben said that he can't continue with the treatment. But I had to go to, to the headquarters. I went there to you, but they refused to give me attention. They said I must commit the medical history. Why would they tell you such a thing? I've never heard of a doctor refusing to treat a patient because of that. This sounds strange. I understand the, the new doctor in our hospital has started work. Yes, yeah, so, well, she she didn't want to give me attention. What? I don't know. I've begged her for over two weeks now. Why must you beg her to do her job? It's her duty. Anyway. I will go and speak with that one. I will speak with that one. Thank you so much. I said that I should come and see you now. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Jim. Oh, sure. I will have to go now. I want to go to the farm. To the farm? In your condition? I don't know what. I have to go and do my are you here to teach me my job? Are you here to tell me what to do? Are you the one who posted me here? Young woman, I am not here to teach you. I am only telling you the right thing. Your job is to save lives. I should take it seriously. Simple. Just take a look at the file. Write your report indicating the treatment so far. That's all. Is that not what you call medical history? Well, he doesn't know what he is saying. I won't give him a medical report. But you can at least give him a referral letter. Well, Joe, you can do that if you so wish. I don't have time for that. I am very certain that he wasn't rejected because of that referral letter. That is not possible. I mean, if it is not necessary, the doctor who was for of giving it to him before he left. He didn't come to my office to tell me to do things that are not necessary. Tell the man you have to do it. And if I don't? I will report it to the headquarters. Well, you better do so before I do. I don't know. We shall see. I hope you do not regret this. I hope it does not get too late for you to do the right thing. Mr. Man, leave my office. Mr. Man, leave my office. If I was not posted to this godforsaken hospital, I'm sure this old looking man wouldn't come here talking to me. Forget your problems, forget your pride. We are here for a very short time. So you show love when you can. Show love. Okay, what is it? I don't know. I, I think my liver is failing me. Do you know, I usually cough up blood. What? Okay, don't worry. The uh, doctor is around. I think you should see her. She has refused to see me. Why? I don't know. Do you know that uh, she sent me out the other day? Oh, don't tell me. She's not like that. She's not bad. I didn't tell you because I, I I don't want to bother you and I, I, I don't want her to insult you because of me. Don't worry, I think she's just stressed. But I'll talk to her, she will do something about your case. I don't know, let me get something for you. Somebody in your neighborhood Please 
Please don't wait for later. Later. Try and make a life much better. Yes, who's there? Come in. Oh, no, so be on. See? Why is this fire here? Dr. B. B. Kim is dying. Oh, that's the truth. My dear, I don't want to talk about it. Do you know that that fool actually sends an old man here to insult me? Bikim is not who you think he is. Who is not? Oh, who is he? And why does he keep bothering me? See, Dr. B, Bikim has been sick for some time now. Dr. B was supposed to treat him, but he was just angry because Deepa refused him getting married to his daughter. Really? Yes. Well, well, Mr. Bikim, I don't want to talk about that boy anymore. He's just one uh, village illiterate. See, Wickham is one of the nicest young men in this community. Do you know where you are staying? He's the one that plastered and painted it. Is that so? Yes. Is that why he keeps watching me? Well, I can pay him to stay here. Dr. B, it's not like that. He needs your help. We treated him, we tried all we could, but nothing was happening. They had to transfer him to Federal Medical Center. He went there, they asked him to go and get his medical history. Well, Mr. Bima, that is not possible. No doctor in the headquarters will reject him because of his medical history. That's what he said. Anyway, what is wrong with him? What disease does he have? He said um, hepatitis B. He has hepatitis B? Yes. My Why didn't he tell me? He tried all he could to tell you, but you were giving him a cold attitude. Jesus. I actually thought he was one of these village beggars and misquants. He's not. See, as a matter of fact, Bikem is a... He's a nice person. He's not a bad boy at all. He's not. Do you know the sickness in question? He actually contacted his trying to save one small boy from drowning. Oh, what have you done? What have I... I need to see him right away. Do you know where he lives? I do. Please take him to his house. Okay. Forget your problems. Forget your lies. We are here for a very short time. So you... Sorry, let me get my bag. Where are you going to? Hey, my bag. Just leave the handbag. I'm coming. My bag is inside. Just hurry up, please. Hurry up. Show kindness to your fellow man. Forget your problems. Forget your pride. We are here for a very short time. Get some antibiotics fast. Forget your problems, forget your pride. We are here for a very 
What happened to him? He has a good time to speak. For how long? So I don't know. There is blood on his mouth. That shows that his liver has been affected badly. Call a stretcher. Nurse! No, 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 no. Tell a nurse to get a stretcher. Okay. Tell one of the nurses to okay. get a stretcher.
meeting has changed. Don't worry. You'll we'll be fine, okay? Who is it to Dr. Beatrice? Just a friend. A friend? Yes. I wonder what is keeping her in her supper. Have you checked her phone? I've tried calling, but her number keeps saying switched off. So much time. Mm. I hope it's not late when she returns. I think so.
Why are you here? <laughs> I tried, I tried my best. Is it enough? What are you talking about? Okay. Too big to be with us. Oh, he didn't make it. Don't talk about what you're saying. Go straight to the point. It is dead. Just tell me it's a joke. That strong man kept to tell you this particular for the past three weeks, and you refused to treat him. Now you open your mouth and tell me you did your best.
talking? Hey! What about me, kid? Hey! I knew it! I knew it! I had this feeling something like this was going to happen! Hey! Hey, Chibo! You see it? That your Dr. Beats or Bean or whatever she's called. Virtually everyone in this village begged her, but she wouldn't listen. Now look at this. We can go mon. Can I go? Mama, you don't like this. Why are you making it look like I didn't put in my effort? <laughs> Mama, you know I tried. Mama, I tried though, I tried. <laughs> Because you've been posted to a rural area. 
Sorry. I blame myself for everything that has happened. God knows I'm going to live with this guilt all my life. My mouth says of guilt, Doctor. Sorry. But why? Why, Doctor Beatrice? Why? Anyway, this is not my business. The disciplinary committee has found you guilty of negligence of duty and you've been suspended indefinitely. Doctor, please kindly help me to something. Nothing. I am not among the disciplinary committee. But Doctor, you can do something. There is absolutely nothing I can do about it. Doctor, please. I said no. No, 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 don't even go there. Don't go there. Get up. Please, please excuse me, I have something important to do. Please! Please, I have a big you. Please. Forget your problems, forget your problems. We are here for a very short time. So you show love when you can. Show love. Your doctor Bean or Beans, whatever it is called, you need to tell her to leave this village immediately. They are planning to attack her. Ah, Mama, who now? It should be and some of the youth leaders. Ah,
Don't wait for later, later, try and make 